they're reloading the program this year. It feels good to have a replenished roster for sure. Um, I think right now we're hungry, we're ready to get on the field, and it's a completely different team, but that's not a bad thing. I think we're different, and we just need to figure out how to work together as a unit. Coach is talking about your determination to kind of lead this team and, mm -hmm. and kind of, I guess, go out on a good note this year. What, what, how would you describe your mindset in that regard? It's been really about getting out of my comfort zone as a leader. Um, I had a lot of practice with it last year for sure because I was one of the only upperclassmen. I still am. So kind of taking over, guiding the younger ones, helping the new players on our team, I think that's going to be really important this year and also focusing on how I can make this my best year because I do want to go out with a bang for my senior season. How much does it take to get comfortable with that, Haley, that you're one of the, like one of only a couple of seniors, but as far as ones who actually were part of the program before, you're the only one, and there's not many of you in general. That so much of this, I mean, it's like relies, it's like on entirely on your shoulders, but there's a lot, whether it's leadership or on the field or what have you, just what does it take to get comfortable with that? It's uh, a lot of responsibility that I have not always had, and it's hard to get comfortable with, but I definitely have a lot of the support from my teammates, and I think I we have a lot of mutual respect on the team, and I definitely have other leaders like Shay on the team helping out, so they make it a lot easier, but it is it is hard to put have that responsibility on my shoulders, but it's a challenge that's been fun to work with, and it's really helped me off the field, too. Coach mentioned Hannah Gailey as someone who had a, a good fall and, and really has opened her eyes a little bit lately. What's your impression of just the work she's put in since last season? You can tell that she's on a mission right now. She wants to you know, solidify her spot on this team, and she's really put in the work, and it's been paying off for her, so I'm really happy for her, and I'm happy to see what she does this season for us. What was kind of the vibe you got after the last fall ball game and the strengths you saw from those games that you want to see translate onto the field these next couple weeks? Yeah, I think we, we played well in the fall. We were battling some injuries, so it's nice to have everyone, for the most part, healthy right now. So that'll help a lot. And it's just building off of that. Uh, it'll be nice. We've been kind of inter-squad scrimmaging a lot, so it'll be nice to work together as a unit and see what we're made of in that sense. So like for you personally to get back on the field, because I know in the fall you missed several of those weekends. So yeah. You really didn't play much at all. Yeah, that was discouraging, but I'm really excited to get back on the field. I've been working really hard this break, and I've been staying focused on my goals for this year personally. So I'm really excited to see how it plays out for us. What does it mean to you to be kind of like the face of this program, a role model for a lot of you know younger softball players in the area? And how do you see yourself in that role? Um, I just try to see myself as a good teammate. Uh, that's what I pride myself on the most and that's what I'm going to focus on. I think the, the social media stuff and all that is a really great way to promote our program and our sport, but I never want that to become a distraction for our team because at the end of the day it's about how we perform on the field and what we can do together as a team. So it's a lot, but I try to, I try to make it team-centered and focus on being the best teammate I can. This is it. Maybe a strange question given the tradition you've been around for three or four years ago, but do you think you can catch some people off guard this year? I mean, or do you think there's an appreciation that you guys have reloaded and are, and are coming with a, a different looking roster than last year? Yeah, I think we have respect as a team for what we did last year with what we had, and I think that people are people know that we replenish, but I don't think they're quite. I don't think they really know what we're capable of. So I'm excited to prove that a little bit, but it's all about doing what we do and playing our game. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys.